Meine liebste Weihnachtstradition, würde ich sagen, ist den Christbaum schmücken. Here at my house, we put it in as soon as possible, but my parents, they are quite strict to the traditions and they put in the tree just the day before Christmas and then we all decorate it together. Merry Christmas, everyone. The Whispering Christmas tour continues and today I will show you my home and traditions in Copenhagen. Come along. My name is Lasse, I'm 38 years old. I run my own business and I live here in Copenhagen with my wife and my two kids. If you like my style and you love some of the Christmas decorations, you can easily shop it at Westbrook. The kitchen I'll show you later, but let's move into the dining area where you can see it's almost Christmas. I would describe our interior style as uh, classic, but with some modern edges, and then we love to play with colors. When we renovated this house, uh, there was actually a wall in here, the dining table, and we wanted to have the living room in here. But when we broke down the wall, we could actually see how the light just came in from both sides of the house, and it made so much sense to make like an area where everyone can sit around the table and talk to the people in the kitchen at the same time. The main focus for us was to keep all of the old elements, such as glass and the fireplace and uh, all the small classic solutions. We love spending Christmas in our house. And on the latest, we've been doing so much more with the kids and it's bringing so much joy. And we're trying to bring in the traditions that we've had in our life. It's super important for us to have a nice decoration around the dining table. The ones I love the most is uh, the Christmas trees that gives a little bit of light and a good atmosphere in the area. This is our living room. Here we spend a lot of time with the kids after school and kindergarten when they are worn out and they need to hang out and see some TV. It's a super important for us that it's a nice place to float and with a comfortable couch and uh, to sit around. When we decorate the Christmas tree, we always do it together. It's a way that the kids can bring on old traditions and they can bring something to the tree that they made themselves. We have something we got from, uh, actually this one from our friend's garden, and uh, then we bring something from our grandparents uh, that they made from uh, when they were young. This room is a good example of mixing uh, old and traditional design together with the, all the new ideas that we have. Uh, for example, the radiator hider, it's over 100 years old and it's super important for us to, to keep that. And also we love the light that the windows bring in with the different colors. We also put in our own modern touch with this a little bit funny wallpaper and then try to tone it a little bit down with the couch and then we added these super cool Christmas pillows. I like playing the guitar when I have a little spare time. Usually I sit here in the living room and just play a little bit. This house is more than 100 years old and this fireplace was here since the beginning. Uh, so it's really important for us. We uh, light it up and then we also think that it adds super nice coziness to the Christmas feeling. So now we're entering the office room. This room is actually a little bit untraditional compared to the other rooms because uh, when we took down the wallpaper in this room, we found out this beautiful wall uh, that you couldn't make by hand. Uh, so we decided to keep it. On the wall here, we wanted to create a lot of storage space uh, so we can get a lot of things away and out so it's easy for the kids to take. And also it's uh, a piece from our own company and we think that the metal adds a really nice look to the wall behind. So as promised, we are back in the kitchen. The most important thing for us in the kitchen was to keep the old traditional style and that's why we choose the colors and we choose uh, the motifs on the front of the kitchen. 
We made this little coffee corner because we both love a great cup of coffee and also it's a good project to do together. And then we think it adds super nice cozy feeling and vibe to the kitchen. One of the biggest tasks with renovating this house was actually digging out the basement. Uh, but now we are getting so much out of it because we have the, our guest room when our parents are over here staying. Then we have a kid's room where they can go and play and make all the noise that they want. And then we actually made a gym, so whenever we want, we can work out. The West Wing Christmas tour continues. Tune in for next week where the team is going to Oslo. This is all for Copenhagen. Bye for now.